If you're not required to run a Chevrolet cylinder head in your particular class or you have a been uh, a boat application or you have just a vehicle just hot rod application something like that uh, we always try to get a vortex head on your motor because the vortex heads run better than the non-vortex heads that's just a fact and the aftermarket uh, cylinder heads would be preferred to the Chevrolet cylinder heads for a number of reasons and it used to be that uh, the, the engine quest CA350C head was the top of the class there it was a, just an excellent cylinder head uh, performance wise had about 180 cc intake runner uh, on it was really good for some um, circle track mild performance applications you know 400 450 horsepower applications well a lot of confusion about that particular cylinder right over the years there's been many different versions of it well it changed again uh, maybe um, about a year ago uh, the current version uh, is is does not even have ch350c on it so if your rules say the CA350C is legal, well, I don't know how they're going to tell because there's nothing on it. The older version did have the C350C on it. This one is made, uh, is, is a lot less performance. Um, it's going to give you a lot less performance in a more open type of an application, meaning if you're running a four-barrel carburetor, a good two-barrel, 7,000 plus RPM, kind of a lighter car, the 180, 185 cc intake runner is going to give you 10, 15 more horsepower. Uh, the new cylinder head uh, is more in the lines of the standard production Chevrolet intake and exhaust port. Uh, you can see that the, the exhaust ports are quite a bit smaller uh, on the new head versus the old cylinder head or the current head. If you order something, that's what you're going to get right here. And the intake ports are also quite a bit smaller. This one is about 165, 167 cc intake runner, and it kind of mimics just your standard production Vortec. So this head will still be uh, recommended, and it would be an advantage versus a standard production, especially a used Chevrolet Vortec uh, cylinder head, because they have a tendency to crack. The new Chevrolet Vortec heads that come on the crates a lot better cylinder head once you modify them. Uh, so this would be a viable option uh, in that type of an application, but it's not going to give you the performance uh, that the old one will in a more open type of an application. So again, we know a lot about Vortex cylinder heads. We've been dealing with the Vortex heads since uh, the late 90s when they come out, and we, we probably know more about these than just about anybody around. I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but anyway, we can direct you in the right direction so that you spend your money wisely and you don't spend money to go slower and you get the right head on your cylinder on your car or your boat or your drag car or whatever so you're not rebuying everything so you just go and concentrate on getting that car around the corner